Hello everyone, this is System Collapse, and I'm back yet again playing the Sky Factories. The Sky Factories, once again. We're back at her, and uh, yeah, I did a bunch of stuff, a bunch of stuff. And I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show you, because I, I, went, I went a little out of hand. I'm not gonna lie, I went out a little out of hand. Uh, these walls here, they probably just like look like walls. Well, they're not, they're not, they're not actually just walls. I, they're, they're, they're reactors. These are these gas turbine reactors that uh, I was working on last episode and I actually have two of them uh, max size stuck in these walls they're just kind of hanging out here and there I've got some of those power capacitors they hold uh, 125 million each uh, I changed how I'm doing them I changed uh, I showed you guys I was gonna do the sin gas then I went on to uh, a wiki and I read about it I wanted to know a little more more about the mod because like I said I never touched it before and uh, yeah yeah, I realized, well, I didn't realize, I found out that you can use, uh, what is it called? What's that stuff I get? Firewater. Firewater. So I'm actually powering this now with firewater. Um, yeah, it's a thing. So these are ender fluid tanks, and yeah, we're pulling tons of firewater in. And, uh, one thing to note, if you guys, if you guys ever try making these, this is actually, actually, I'll pull that up. Oh, this is actually sitting on the flux generator, which pulls out the RF. Uh, I had to use this because the flux points cannot pull energy directly from the uh, whatever that thing was called the flux flux generator there you go so I had to do it this way I had to use capacitor than that I probably could have used a energy conductor as well but uh, I decided not to anyway I have them set up now and these are ridiculous this, this is ridiculous these things are producing 25,000 each I'm getting 50,000 RF out of these and look at the tiny little space they take up. They take up nothing. Nothing. Realistically, I could put, what, two, four, six more and get, what, 200,000 RF? And uh, I'm going to show you how I did the fire water. Oh, let's turn on hover. Boop. And uh, let's go which way? Not that way. We're going to fly. We're going to fly fast. I also moved the tree farm out here because there's an issue with tree farms. Um, when they're automated, like right now, it's not doing much because Batania is not getting any mana. Mana? Any mana? I should probably change that so it is, but uh, it's not using all the uh, charcoal that's coming out of it, so the tree farms aren't running. But uh, I moved out here because those things are lag machines. This thing with all the leaves breaking down, all the trees breaking down, and all the changes, uh, giant lag machine. So I decided to move it out here. It's an uh, eyesore anyway, and uh, keep it out of my base. And I just leave this chunk loaded. Just leave it chunk loaded. But this is how I'm doing my fire water. I'm doing three stacks of, uh, of fire water. I've got, uh, how many? What is that? 24, uh, barrels working on magma blocks all at once. So magma blocks, uh, with water equals fire water. Simple as that. Just sit them there and it'll slowly convert. And that is the thing. So this one you'll see is transforming, transforming 36%. So I'm just using the sinks to fill the water and pumping it straight into the ender tank. So that is the thing. That is how I'm doing it. It's not a big deal. It's actually really simple. And I'm just using retrieval nodes with a filter on it. And these filters are kind of cool because they can filter liquids. And you just put the bucket, a bucket of the liquid you want to filter in there. And yeah, it'll only pull that liquid. So that is the thing. So that is how I'm getting tons of fire water. And in a tight little space, I have it all in one chunk uh, just so I can uh, load chunk load less areas because less areas chunk loaded means less lag. But my main goal is to get well this mob grinder. We want the draconic evolution mob grinder because I want to set up an auto killing wither farm. Uh, I have the wither skulls coming in all the time now, nonstop, and I just want to be able to fully automate this and never have to worry about Nether Stars again. Let it do its thing. Um, but I need this because this one sh one hit kills withers and it makes the process extremely fast and safe So this is the thing. There's also a couple other things. I want from draconic evolution, but we'll get to those at the time um, So yeah, this is my goal, but there is a problem because well quake and draconium the recipe for that Well, well boom you gotta get in the fusion crafting So we're gonna get in the fusion crafting and this takes ridiculous amounts of RF just just throwing that out there <laughs> ridiculous amounts, but uh I don't think it'll be too much of a problem. We'll see. We'll see. But uh, this is tier we Wyvern, and there's actually different tiers. So let's look at Draconic. Boom. 
which means we gotta start with the basic fusion and use then you have to upgrade it to this like so there it's multi-staged very multi-staged you need to make eight of the basics so you can make the wyverns and yeah it's a pain but it needs to be done so we're gonna get on that uh, but there's one thing I want to get to first so right now I have all this in here well I don't need the dust the dust is fine let's put the dust into the system Boop. but these ores I, I'm getting a lot of these ores now and I think I have a lot more in here Boop. oh not crayonic it's probably draconic there we go no I don't have that many more but I have no way to double up on my draconic ore right now, so you're, I'm going to end up using a ton of that, a ton of draconic ore really soon. So I need to get the maximum out of it. So the way to do that easily is a machine from actually add-ons called the Crusher, and uh, we're we're going to make that real quick. So um, there was some part of it I didn't need. Oh yeah, I need redstone. So we're going to get some redstone. 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 Oh, it's on set the, this. There we go. Redstone. I only have 10,000 of it. So, oh, that's essence. Let's put essence back in. I'm probably going to have to reduce how many uh, uh, redstone I'm getting there. Oop. There we go. That'll do. Let's throw those back in. Boom. I don't even need that many. I don't even know why I grabbed that many. I brought that stuff up here, but uh, we're going to make some restonia. And I don't know how much of this I could do, but we'll just do this and see what happens. Oh, it only did one, but we can break it and make some more. There we go. And... Boom. I'm pumped to use this thing later. I have a big plan for this later. Yeah, it's going to be fun, but we got to get to that. But uh, I'm, I'm not going to drop any spoilers. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. So we're going to throw this in here, though. Boop, boop, boop. And we're going to use what, two of those. Grab that. Boop. Throw those in there. Look at the crusher. The rest of the stuff's pretty simple, I think. I have tons of that black quartz. I think I only need two, right? Two. And one of these casings. Okay. Let's throw that in there. That in there. And grab Crusher. Boom. And I might as well try. I haven't tried automating one of these yet. I haven't a clue. So let's try. Uh, do I have an importer? Yes, I do. And let's try an exporter. There we go. And we're probably going to need a recipe. So let's go here. Let's go to... Conic ore and find the correct recipe. I want dust, don't I? Dust. Get the dust. Is that the right crusher? No, we want this crusher. Go. It gets only turned to one. This is the recipe I want right here. So, boop. We're going to try that. Um, we'll need to take that downstairs, I guess. Oh, I probably need some cables as well. So, let's get to that. Do I have any in here? Boom. Oh, I forgot to mention too. I lost my bags. My bags are all gone. All gone. All gone. I don't know what happened. My something happened. I was working with Ender IO conduits. Uh, the when I was working on the uh, firewater, something glitched out, and I ended up with three sets of Devil Tails. Two of them were in my, like two more sets in my inventory. Ended up with three rings of magnetization. Uh, my boots disappeared for a while and came back. My helmet ended up in my, like. Everything was all messed up. I don't know what happened, but one second I was working on conduit. I put it down. It like made the sound that it went down that disappeared. And then I checked my inventory and it was all messed up. So I have no idea what happened. Uh, obviously a glitch, but uh, I lost my bag and I don't even remember who was in it. So I'm probably going to have to look at a past episode to see what stuff I actually need to make in there. I know my nets and some other stuff. A lot of my tools are in there anyway. But uh, that's a thing. That's a thing. The joys of, of uh, new modded's. New uh, game packs? Mod packs? There you go. Uh, do I have everything? I'm going to need some more cables, and I don't think I set up the auto crafting for those yet, did I? Display. Normal. Only craftables. No, I haven't done cables yet, of course. Boop. Let's do that. Do that. Let's do cable. Cable? Oh, yeah. I don't have it set because it makes it hard to do this. There we go. Boop. boop. Let's throw that into a crafter real quick. Boop. And then a cable. Stop doing the crafting matter. Stop it. Let's play. No craftables. Only craftables. There we go. Let's do... Do a bunch. I'll be using a ton. There we go. I'll just bring a stack. Boom. Don't need that many, but it's a thing. Boop. And 
where we need. Let's turn that off. And where should we set it up? Let's set it up in a spot where nothing's at yet. Eh, just looks good. Boop. And we'll throw this here. Oop, I'm guessing, oops, I'm guessing it's going to work uh, pretty simply, so let's hope. We need, going to need, we got the importer. I guess I don't need the importer, I just need an exporter, don't I? Uh, not an exporter, an importer. Boop. Should only need an importer, so that's not going to work at all, so let's not do that. And let's put a hole in the floor for a second. There we go. Turn hover on. There we go. And we'll do this and try some cables. Nope. Oop. And what's above this? Shit. This floor? Yes, it is. Doesn't matter. It's hooked to everything anyway. It should be all fine. Boom. Oh, yeah, because that's touching that. There we go. Oh, I do need to access that crafter for a second. It's the only flaw in my design. To get to the crafters, boom. I have to do this. Boop. And there we go. Hopefully that's already automated. So let's, let's see. Let's see if I can. Oh, oh, I did something wrong. I did something wrong. I just killed my connection to a bunch of my computers. Ah, she here. Where did I put that? Boom, boom. Ooh. I'll just do temporary fix. Boop and boop. There we go. That'll power that up. And I should be able to put these here. Boop, boop. Doesn't need to be clean right now. I always clean things up later anyway. There we go. Everything's powered again. And go to a craft grid. And throw this stuff in. Control, control, shift. And see if we can order it up. Is it working? That is the question. Oh, yeah. Power would help. <laughs> I'm a genius. Here we go. Power, and this should just fire right up, hopefully. We'll go here, we'll put on network three, and there you go. There you go. Let's just make sure it's pulled out. And it's pulled out. There we go. That's automated. We can double up our uh, draconium. That is a good thing. Okay, so that's done. But uh, that was just the first part of it. And uh, we need to make the crafters now for fusion crafting. That machine is friggin' loud, I have to say. That is ridiculous. Uh, let's see here, basic, so how many of these do I need? So use was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and piece of fusion injector. Does it go on an altar? Is that the way it works? I should make the book so I could understand it, but I have seen it done. I've just never done it myself. Energy infuser, I don't think that's it. Pain sensor. Let's make the book real quick. Boom. So one of these. Boop. 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 And this. Whoa. And. Oh, I thought my game was going to crash for a second. There we go. Draconium. Draconium tools. Energy. Upgrade. Where is fusion? It should just say. I would think say. Oh, fusion crafting. There we go. So. Basic fusion crafting injector. Okay. Yeah, but what, what what is that thing in the middle? Just tell me. <laughs> Why won't the mod just tell me what's in the middle? Fusion crafting setup. That's that's wonderful. Doesn't matter. That picture again. I will never get it again. Boom. So I don't want to open the image in the browser. So it's like a f but four blue corners on the thing. I know this stuff doesn't matter. All that matters and the shape, how far apart, doesn't really matter. Let's look let's look for that thing. Where is that? Is that it? Fusion crafting core. There we go. That's what we're gonna need. So let's make that. Fusion crafting core. And we should be in a crafter. Boop, boop. And definitely can't make that yet. Let's make one of these. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. Fusion craft core. And we need seven of these. Oh yeah. So I'm gonna need seven of those things. So boop. One, two, three, four, five. No, it was six, wasn't it? Or was it eight? I should pay attention. Not very good. There we go. I need eight. <laughs> uh, different recipes take different amounts, but uh, that is the thing. 
Let's throw that in there. So this is six, then I'll need two more cores. So these. Boop, boop, boop. And two more. Bam, bam, bam. There we go. And we're obviously going to need some flux points. Flux points. Uh, I don't know if the core needs power or not, but we'll, we'll pretend that it does and grab one anyway. There we go. Boop. And I'll just set this up anywhere. Let's, uh, let's go over, go over here. This seems like a good spot. I want to get away from that friggin' uh, crusher. Yeah, it's great that it's doubling up, but god, it's loud. Uh, and I want some placement box. So let's just grab some, some of anything. Yo, wood will work. There we go. So, we're gonna go something like this. Oh yes, it goes like that. That's right. Do this a little different. Boop, boop, boop. And boop, boop, boop. Break those. Of course I brought wood. Something my drill doesn't work on. I still need to upgrade my drill. I keep forgetting that. I keep avoiding it. But it's something I need to do. So let's put it like right there. Take our fusion crafters and put one there, one there, one there, one there. There we go. Then we'll vein mine that. Oop. Of course, it doesn't vein mine. What was that? Two away? So one, two, three. And this will end up moved. It's probably going to end up on the second floor, but uh, I just want to get it started. Because you're going to be using this machine a ton. Like, an actual ton. Like, there's, that's the weight. That's how much it weighs. Like, no. <laughs> if you're going to be upgrading your draconic uh, weaponry, you're going to be using this thing a lot. And you're going to be using it a lot for just uh, um, Awakened Draconium. So, you're going to be getting into... Uh, that mod, you're going to be using it a lot. I think we don't need to do that. Uh, let's grab the points. And I should be able to throw them in the center. Yes, I can. Beautiful. I'll put that one on network three. And actually, let's put them both on that. Whoa. I don't understand what's going on. Do, you, do, you, do you people see that? That is totally glitched out. Okay. Let's pretend that didn't happen. It was, like, attached, but... Oh, I know what's happening. It's... <laughs> That's hilarious. That was actually, uh, in the core. That's, uh, actually how you do the crafting. I'm gonna put that one on three as well. And... Is this good to go? Let's test it and see... If, uh, I need the, uh... Thing powered up. The fusion crafter. Okay, so we want to awaken Draconium. O W A K E N D D. Oh, uh, recipe. Recipe? There we go. We're going to need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of the cores. Oh, six cores and a Dragon's Heart? Okay, we can't do that first. I forgot. First, I need the Wyvern tier. Let's go to Draconic. Doing this all wrong. Nope. Oh. Draconic. There we go. And we'll go to Wyvern Fusion Crafting. So we're going to need a seven. Oh, is that eight? We're going to need eight Wyvern cores. Because I think we need one for each pedestal. So eight Wyvern cores. Sixteen Draconic cores. Holy moly. Okay, let's start this. Um, here. I'm going to need to make another recipe here. Not that. Go to dust, grab this, go, I don't want to make that, I want to make ingots, go, ingots, where's the draconium, that's the night slime, there we go, draconium, easiest way would be, let's just do that one, bam, we're going to need this recipe real quick, boop, should have already done this, but uh, that's the thing. I'm running around in circles. There we go. The floor is so white, <laughs> I'm not used to it. I need some kind of marker or different coloring around, so I don't always run in circles like a moron. Um, <laughs> it's something I've been doing. Uh, so that was in the furnace. Let's throw that here. Boop. And boop. There we go. 
hopefully I got enough draconium to at least make the fusion stands and get this made. Oh, I don't need that now. Go that there. And we need, what was I working on? Uh, tons of that. I need to make craftables. Only craftables. Let's make as, oh, nope. Need to make as much as this as we can. We'll just let it go like that and it'll do what it needs to. There we go. It'll tell me when it can't make more, but it's making a ton. Uh, let's start with that. There we go. Uh, okay, let's go to Draconic again and work out the math really quick. So I'm going to need seven of these. So let's make seven of these really quick. So seven of those is going to be 28 Draconic cores. So let's do 28 of these. Let's throw some of these back in. There we go. Oh, made more, but I'm going to need more anyway, so it doesn't even matter. And then I should be able to just make the cores, right? Boom. Throw those in there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, I didn't have enough. I'm out of nether stars. Okay. Well, I might go kill some nethers. Not nethers. I'm going to go kill some withers. I still have my wither cage, and uh, I'm going to need... How many do I need? Not many. One, two... I literally only need to kill two. Do I need any for this? No, I don't. Okay, I probably only need to kill one to two withers. No point making you guys watch. I'll be right back. Okay, and I'm back. I'm back after realizing I didn't even have a sword yet. So I had to go make a sword and I crafted up the wyvern cores. Then I crafted up some draconian blocks and the rest of the cores I need. So I think I have everything I need now. And we're going to try to do this. Also, I came to the conclusion after looking at the recipe one more time. I'm going to need one more extra fusing crafting injector because I need eight to do it and I need one to be able to convert. So that is the thing. And uh, I think the way I seen this done before was you can actually stack these and do multiples at once maybe. I'm not sure how it works, but uh, we're going to try it out. So that's eight. That's eight. Let's, let's do this. So this, 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 this should go into cra to the things. Da, da, da. Are they called injectors? Whatever they're called. Boom and boom. What are they called? Basic fusion crafting injectors. So I think I can just do this. Yes, it does take a stack. I don't know if it makes them all at once or one at a time, but uh, we're going to find out. Boop, boop, and boop. And we're going to try putting this in. So these are powered. I also grabbed some Viber capacitors. I just made a couple more real quick. Um, to make sure that everything was getting power. So is that's one problem with flux points. You have to go into the menu to see if they're working. So let's try this. And oh, we got a start button. And that's charging pretty quick. Wow. That looks awesome. I have seen this before, but Still looks awesome. That sound though, it could drive you crazy. It sounds like typewriters. Heartbeats in a typewriter. <laughs> Let's back up a bit. Boom. And I got my first one. Sweet. So yeah, there we go. We, we got this working. We got to do this. <laughs> Seven more times. But I am going to make the last one. I might as well. Let's uh, grab that out. Break this. Then I know they're all upgraded. And I don't have to think about these anymore. I can worry about the next tier. Because there's still another tier to do. At least one tier. I don't know if there's two or one tier. But I should grab this out too. Boop. Throw that there. Throw that there. And throw that there. And hit start. And after this, I can make my way in Draconium. And then we have a mob grinder. We have a mob grinder. And I think I can actually also make my charm as well. Charm? It is a charm, isn't it? Just look up dislocation. Charm dislocation. This thing, yes. I'll be able to make this. Oh, I could have already made this. Oh, it had to be Wyvern tier. Well, we'll probably make that next episode. Boom. Look at that. 
So cool. So cool. It's amazing. Boom. Throw that there. And that is not how it goes. Throw that there. There we go. Boop. Oh my goodness. It's because it's the last one. There we go. So that's done. That's done. We can grab our diamonds back. Give me them. Give me, give me all my diamonds. Give me them. Needs them. There we go. Throw that there. And the recipe was... Look. Awakened. One more time. Awakened. Boom. Boom. Four of the... Six of the Traconicors and a heart. So... Six. Boop. Boop. That's not right. Knowing how you have to do that. Yep. One. Four. Five. Six. My heart. And it was four blocks of draconium, I believe. That's right. We got a start button. And there you go. Our first awakened draconium. How's my power doing? Not even hurting yet. Amazing. I guess it doesn't hurt that during the daytime right now, I'm getting... Well, it's not daytime right now. During the daytime, though, I'm getting close to 80,000 RF a tick now, so... That is what? Every 10 seconds... 800,000? <laughs> no, what am I talking about? Every second, that's... 1.6 million? 1.6 million, so... Oh, this one's taking a while to charge. <laughs> wow! That is a thing. Okay. This one is taking a while. Not draining my batteries yet, so we should be okay. Did I set the... these? I'm scared to go in here. Did that help? Go downstairs. Let's see if we can get this going any faster. Uh, ignore limit on this one. True. Ignore limit. That one. True. Ignore limit on that one. True. Ignore limit. True. Ignore limit. True. Did that help? <laughs> no, it did not help at all. I think I am tapped. I'm getting close to tapped. Okay. Well. I think I'll cut for about two or three minutes, and I'll be right back when this is done, and we'll get this finished up. Be right back. Okay, I'm back, and we're just about finished. It literally t took like five, six minutes for it to get to this point, but uh, it is almost done. So, ah, almost there. Can't wait until I have massive batteries to charge this thing. I really need the Draconic Powerball to, to, uh be able to power this thing efficiently not draining my batteries but it's it's taking all the output that I have oh here we go and bam we got our first awakened draconium check that out and I'm going to do immediately what I intended to do with it. Because, well, that's what I wanted. I got my mob grinder. Where is she? Where is it at? Mob, no, mob grinder? Mob, mod, mod. Mob grinder. There we go. So it's that. Make one of these. I should actually look at a crafter. I'm too excited now. Boop, boop. Oh, I do have everything for that. Sweet. I thought I was going to have to make another brick. And I'm going to have to break one of these down. So, boom. Let's just break one. Boop, boop. And we're going to need three diamond swords. One, two. Go. And I should have it. Oh, of course I don't have something. need one of these. Of course it's the expensive one, too. Three, four. Boop. One of those. Are you serious? I need a heart. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Okay, this video is getting long. I'm going to end it here. I'll start next video, I guess, crafting that and getting right to it. Because we're going to be using that next video anyway. That was the whole point of this video. I want this mob grinder so we can get to auto automating wither killing. So, 
It's fine if I start at the, de the next video. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. I really just wanted to end the video with making that, but, uh, yeah. It happens. Ah, oh, nether stars. They are the bane of my existence. But once I have automation set up, they'll no longer be my bane. I'll be able to make them whenever I want. I can even automate it. I can leave it on. I could I could produce enough withers just to make them non-stop if I feel like. And actually, at some point, I'm going to need over 40,000 nether stars. So, that is a thing. So, yeah. Anyway. I'm going to end this video here. I think I did pretty good. I mean, we got through fusion crafting and we automated the crusher. The fusion crafting, of course, is way cooler. This is pretty cool how it works. Um, I'm going to have to get a better setup on this, but uh, definitely, definitely cool. And I'm definitely going to have to get more power in here. But, uh, yep, I'm going to end this video. Uh, if you liked it, please leave a like as always. If you really liked it, uh, please hit that subscribe button. It's much appreciated and, uh, yeah. I, I, I love I love having my community is great. You guys have been so positive, so amazing, so wonderful. It just it's just great. I've only been doing this like I keep saying just a few weeks, but uh, yeah, the support's been amazing. It's been amazing, and I, I'm gonna keep doing it. I'm not gonna stop. We're just gonna keep adding more and more and more. I'm gonna be doing other series, so this and that. But I'm gonna stop ranting. Gonna keep it short this time, and uh, you guys all have a good one. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode where we do some awesome wither killing automation. I got a cool way to do it. Anyway, later.